We are here in Sertogenbos, the uh, city center. Uh, near the River Dommel uh, is located the Marienburg. Uh, Marienburg is the monastery of the Society of the Sisters of JMJ. And we will uh, transform the building into a university complex for the graduate school. The building is built 120 years ago as a building for residential and education. And it's fantastic that it will be used uh, for education again for the graduate school as a school campus. So here at the Marienburg, uh, we'll have a, a graduate school. And this graduate school will be comprised of several research offerings and several educational offerings. We will boast a joint master program on data science and entrepreneurship. Blend of developing new business models, new products, new services and data science. We will also have a PDENG program. On top of that, a PhD program. And last but not least, we will also facilitate lifelong learning. So it will be very vibrant because we'll have the academics, we'll have the students of all those levels, starting from the master degree up to professionals who come back here to learn and to teach at the same time. And next to that, of course, we'll also host new companies. These can be startups, startups from our own students here, from the Marienburg, but likewise, what we think will be a very vibrant hub, attracting companies from all over Europe and all over the world. This is the chapel, the heart of the monastery. And we will turn this into the main auditorium of the complex. A very important place, of course, because here will be the lectures, the public events, but also the graduation of the students. And here, at this location, we will build in uh, a big tribune with 200 seats. And a very uh, good example is the theater in Helmond, which is built in a church as well. Besides uh, the auditorium, we will create different facilities, classrooms, office space, study areas, lunch room, hotspot, and also uh, facilities for incubators. I think it's a beautiful place. It's a very authentic place that has always hosted students. So having said that, this is a fantastic location to start with something new, to revitalize it with the latest facilities, lab rooms, spaces for living labs, of course, the conventional lecture rooms, particular rooms for students so they can do their group work, and in particular, where they can work on the data entrepreneurship in action courses. This is the courtyard of the monastery, and we will turn this into the central meeting place of the school by adding a glass roof over it and adding different terraces at different levels. The central meeting place where students and staff meet, where they have lunch, where they study at these different levels. We will add new constructions, modern furniture. And together with these beautiful old walls, we can create a very uh, lively and nice atmosphere in this atrium. Visitors of the Marienburg, which can also be national scholars, international scholars, PhD students, uh, PDENG students, they could all stay here at the Marienburg, where we'll revamp these rather old dorms for sisters into very modern dorms where they can stay overnight and they can work together and live together, in fact, with the community of data scientists. We have chosen for the Bosch as the place to put the graduate school on data science for a number of reasons. One of the most important reasons is the fact that the Zettelgen Bos area already hosts a very vibrant community of young startups and of IT companies, like the Haas and like Avant, and we want to collaborate with them, in fact, later on in the data science initiative. This location is perfect for the university, uh, I think, because it's in the middle of the city centre, but at the same time it's a very quiet, peaceful and green area. It's a great opportunity to change uh, this former monastery 
into a vibrant campus for the graduate school.